so in this video uh, i am interacting with sandeepan sandeepan is doing his mtech in iit jodhpur in cyber physical system so maybe many things uh, even i was not aware you know there are three ways to enter into iit jodhpur one with gate score uh, with stipend another gate score without stipend and third is uh, self sponsored category you know self sponsored category is in iit hyderabad also but there the cost of entire mtech is 12 lakh but in iit jodhpur the 12 lakh reduces to 4 lakh in 2 years that's it and self this uh, without stipend um, mtech also is of 2 lakh only you will not get stipend so for 2 uh, years that is a cost but at low gate score like sandeepan is having 540 his general category student and uh, his 540 electrical engineering he got iit jodhpur one very interesting thing i came to know that iit jodhpur mein hostel fees is not there in fact you get a single room air conditioned room for you the ac expenditure and everything iit jodhpur is bearing placement is 100% in fact very good placement there so please listen to this entire video you will get a lot of ideas and maybe you will in better position to convert your gate score but one thing is very important you need to prepare opportunities will come you need to prepare for interviews you need to prepare for other things like applying and you know sops and all opportunities are there for any gate score you have opportunities are there make a right decision job market is booming lot of opportunities are there and you can get a job of 15 lakh 10 10 to 15 15 to 18 lakh depending upon your skills and irrespective of your branch you can get very good jobs listen to this entire conversation i'm very sure you'll get a lot of uh, you know information from this okay so sandeepan let's let me first thank you for the time you spared for this interaction yes sir thank you okay sandeepan now uh, i'm going to interact with you and uh, i'll be knowing more about the course which you are pursuing uh, presently you are doing your mtech in iit jodhpur and uh, the uh, course in which you are presently that is cyber physical system yes sir. so sandeepan i want to know about you uh, i want uh, that you tell us about uh, your background like from where you graduated uh, which year what was cgpa and uh, how many times you wrote gate and what was their gate score which provide uh, got you admission in iit jodhpur and i'm very sure with that gate score and cgpa and your category you must have got some more options also so please uh, tell us about that also okay sir so i have completed my electrical engineering from uh, a private college in kolkata it's called heritage institute of technology and uh, my CGPA was 7.95. Okay. okay. Uh, and I have graduated in 2020 mm -hmm. and I took one year drop and then mm -hmm. I have retained the gate for the second time in 2021. Okay. And my category was general mm -hmm. and my score was 540. Okay. 540. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. So... With that score, I have uh, initially I have applied uh, many inter interdisciplinary branches in the IITs and I was uh, exploring various opportunities. Actually, uh, with this score, you are not going to get any offer from IIT in directly co through COP. Okay. Mm -hmm. So there were some opportunities like, uh, like IIT Hyderabad offers some self sponsored scores. And in IIT Jodhpur also, there are two categories which you can apply if you have a little less goal like in my case it was uh, uh, admission in uh, through gate but it was without stipend category okay. so i i do not get stipend okay mm -hmm. okay so mm -hmm. in this category initially as per is i remember in cyber physical system all the branches have these categories like in iit jodhpur you get through direct cope admission you get through gate but you do not get stipend this is called without stipend category mm -hmm. and the third option is sales sponsored category okay so in sales sponsored category your semester fees gets doubled mm -hmm. that's the thing usually we pay around 45000 per semester mm -hmm. but in sales sponsored category you are going to pay around 75000 it's not that costly also. In okay. IIT Hyderabad sales-sponsored, you have to pay around 11 lakhs in two years. But mm -hmm. in IIT Jodhpur, you can cover it within four lakhs. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. 
so my stream is cyber physical system mm -hmm. and it is it comes under electrical engineering only okay in so, electrical so department sandeepan before you tell us about your department you have provided us very very crucial information uh, let me tell you that is very very important so yeah. you told that in iit jodhpur if somebody is having low gate score mm -hmm. and wants to get into mtech then there are some options one you said without stipend yes sir and uh, then you said there is a self sponsored also but it is very very cheap yes so i again want to know like without stipend if you are doing you will not get 12500 rupees per month stipend no. but what is the fee structure can you tell me that like it is exactly years, same it okay. is exactly same mm -hmm. who are getting admission through co like direct okay. admission through get score mm -hmm. and uh, in my case without stipend we we both category students have basically exactly same okay. fee structure okay. like you are going to pay around 45000 per semester okay on okay. average mm -hmm. so for so semester, 2 lakh mein mtech ho jayega yes 2 lakh mein ho jayega mm -hmm. and in self sponsored case you can take around 3.5 to 4 lakhs in uh, pura 2 saal ka pura 2 saal ka to jahan it hyderabad mein 12 lakh lag rahe hain wahan yahan 4 lakh mein ho jayega yes 4 lakh mein lag raha hai and this this fees includes your hostel fees mess fees Achha. everything in jo IIT... to kafi cheap hai that way right yes and in iit jodhpur actually there is no hostel fees you are mm -hmm. only going to pay mess fees Achha. and you are going to get separate single room with ac Achha. Achha. with ac every AC. student gets yes because of that <laughs> yes sir, because of the temperature in rajasthan you know so they have Achha. provided us that facilities so every student gets a ac room uska electricity ka bill tum nahi doge nahi 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 acha good so the, i tell you that uh, that was i was not even knowing that yeah because, that's you know, why i am giving you the information <laughs> <laughs> you know we used to be in id delhi at delhi mein kabutar khana hota tha chota sa hostel <laughs> 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 दो लोगों को फिट करते हैं वो लोग वहां पे नो आईटी दिल्ली आई एम फैन ऑफ आईटी दिल्ली आई एम एल्युमिनी ऑफ दैट एल्युमिनस ऑफ दैट बट आई टेल यू आई एम कंपेयरिंग एक्चुअली कि आईटी दिल्ली में तो बहुत ही छोटा रूम होता था एंड आईटी जोधपुर में एसी भी मिल रहा है सो यू आर लिविंग किंग साइज लाइक राजस्थान गुड ओके संदीप नाउ नाउ कमिंग टू यू नो दिस योर डिपार्टमेंट यस सर डिपार्टमेंट के बारे में थोड़ा बताएं so first of all i would like to give some more important information like with that score mm -hmm. students usually get tempted to go for admission in nit warangal nit suratkal this type of branch and uh, the uh, crucial information i want to give that in iit jodhpur mtech this year our seniors almost 95% of them are already placed wonderful so placement is crazy placement this year huh? yes sir this year in every iit i think the placement has gone up so in our case also this is very similar situation everyone is getting placed i can see but uh, there is very less core opportunities almost every student is getting placed in software domain only okay so this is another thing and there is another factor in our college every branch like every specialization in mtech are having students around 12 i think so there is actually 15 seats but there are four to five seats are vacant every okay. year in okay. in my case my class has only 10 students so chhod ke chale gaye join hi nahi kiye ek do chhod ke chala gaya hai aur join bhi nahi kiya hoga like that mm -hmm. so so maybe this little amount of students gets benefited in the placement actually placement But, like in nit warangal every specialization has 31 seats like power system power electronics these branches are 31 seats and if you see the placement structure you will see that only 13 to 15 students get placed out of 31 mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so uh, there is a benefit in joining this iits new iits i would say mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and then now i want to go to the portion like admission procedure so in without stipend category i think around 75 to 80 people were shortlisted and the score was i think around 475 plus or maybe you can say 500 plus it was the cut off for getting call of without stipend category and after that they conducted interview so in that interview cyber physical system mainly it is a smart technology of control system you can say it is more oriented to control system 
so they mainly asked about the control systems and all from and they asked about my project my btech project was from another domain but i prepared a control system project for that interview and i okay. told so you saying for mtech there is interview yes sir mm -hmm. in for these two uh, admission like without stipend category and sales mm -hmm. concert category there will be interview mm -hmm. and interview is the key factor mm -hmm. because only two students will be getting selected out of this 80 people mm -hmm. only two or three will be selected so this is the case so i prepared control system project deliberately for this interview because i knew that control system will play a key factor mm -hmm. so after that i got the call and uh, another iit opportunity i got that is in iit guwahati this year only there is a branch in ms uh, disaster management and mitigation yes. so i got that opportunity also but i decided not to go there that mm -hmm. was which stipend but mm -hmm. i still prefer to be that, in electrical that option domain. you got for ms or mtech ms sir ms so you got interview call there and you cleared it and you got it yes 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 okay mm -hmm. great so from iit these only these two options i got and mm -hmm. i decided to go in iit jodhpur mm -hmm. and now coming to the cyber physical system course it is basically physical systems where uh, artificial brain is injected like some okay. kind of processors are there embedded processors or like that and you have to design like control laws for suppose a robot is an example of cyber physical system so you need to perform some tasks by these robots so you will be designing the control laws such, such that these robots can perform a work mm -hmm. so this and in cyber physical system the coursework is little bit hectic because honestly there are a lot of domains coinciding in in cyber physical systems like computer systems computer subjects will be there like communication network communication will be there then you have to study embedded processors if someone is interested then they can opt for vlsi related subjects also where they can design processors also and uh, i decided to take machine learning in the first semester so i get some placement oriented field mm -hmm. so there are a lot of things the one negative point i would like to say that in other colleges mtech program you have six subjects in first semester you have another six subject in second semester mm -hmm. and in third and fourth semester they only do project work there is no course work but in iit jodhpur in the third semester you will have to go through another three subject okay. and in the fourth semester also you have to take one subject so okay. you have to clear four extra subject compared to other institute so okay. this is i will say a little bit negative point hmm. okay sandeepan so very beautifully you explained everything and now i am coming to the most important part what i understood is like iit jodhpur does not charge anything for uh, hostel in fact provides you air conditioning facilities also single room comfortable zone they have provided you yes also you told me fees is very less i mean there are two or more opportunities for those students who do not have that high gate score you said that uh, it is maybe self sponsored also and maybe without stipend category also yes but now the most important thing comes is placement part Mm. Uh, sandeepan when uh, we uh, join any course our main intention is to go for uh, placements right yes sir so if some student says sir i'm, I'm i want to join iit jodhpur i'm getting admission in jodhpur and i'm from the very first day i'm ready to job join any job mm. core non core anything and i'm ready to upskill myself also can i think of getting job of 15 lakh per annum yes it is possible so i would be honest about this placement thing like i said this year placement is almost getting touched to 100% but mm -hmm. these courses are relatively new like uh, we are fourth batch of cyber physical system if i am not wrong yes we are the fourth batch so the placements is getting better every year yes. so like in this year it is almost up to 100% now about the package now there are three specialization data science artificial intelligence and computer science these three branch students can easily get 15 lakhs from iit jodhpur in mtech i can say this but in 
electrical domain there are two specializations cyber physical system another one is sensor and internet of things these two branches are there now in these two branches this year the placement is almost 100 percent but the average package you can say it is around 10 to 11 lakhs okay so in two branch in these two branches around 20 to 25 students are there almost 22 are placed she are going for PhD, something like that. I have listened. Mm -hmm. So you can say that uh, uh, out of that 20 students, only two or three students have got a package around 18 lakhs. Okay. I am sure that students are from CSE background only. Mm -hmm. Now from coming to cyber physical system department placement. Mm -hmm. So here our one of the seniors, two or three of the seniors have got package around 12.5. Mm -hmm. And uh, then another, uh, there are some seniors who have got package around 9.5, 10, mm -hmm. and mostly the companies are like Deloitte, TCS mm -hmm. Innovation has come and they have to take in only one student, but uh, innovation is a good, like it is mm -hmm. oriented to, you can say like it is a co placement mm -hmm. something, but mostly mm -hmm. consultancy, IT services, they are coming. Mm -hmm. But I can say that uh, it doesn't depend on the mtech degree or something like that from the very first day we have entered the college we are allowed to sit in placements like okay. so one of my batch mm -hmm. he didn't even keep the first semester also he already got placed in the okay. first semester okay. only okay i didn't know if this is possible but i am seeing like he got placed in cements mm -hmm. so the package is around 12 to 13 lakhs only, I think. Mm -hmm. So this is the thing, but there are many companies coming, like they are providing internship up to 1.5 lakhs per month also. Okay. But, and they are not discriminating anyone like we take him, take anything. It is like if the student has quality, they can get placed. Like mm -hmm. I am saying the average package in MTech is this year around 11 to 10, or maybe you can say some students got 12. And there is one or two exception who has got eight. Mm -hmm. But if the students have all the students have quality, mm -hmm. then all of them can get can 18 get lakhs, mm -hmm. can get 18 lakhs package because yes. I have listened in like we do not have dedicated VLSI course in IID Jodhpur. Mm -hmm. So in cyber physical system and SIOT, you are getting some elective courses related to VLSI. Mm -hmm. So then I listened that Intel came in college and none of the mtech students could go get to the intel interview because okay. they are probably looking for the dedic dedicated vlsi engineers and they didn't get here mm -hmm. so if the students had the quality maybe some of them could have got the intel also mm -hmm. so this is the thing mm -hmm. so it depends on the students how much they are preparing for yeah. the placement but mm -hmm. i would like to say the coursework is little hectic I am not sure the how much can a student put effort for the placement, dedicated placement person. But for PhD, you will get many opportunities from this college. Okay. So what kind of opportunities for PhD, Sandeepan? Like uh, my guide, he, is, he has done PhD from Canada and postdoctorate from, I think, somewhere in Europe also. Mm. So he has told me that if I really work good, research work under him. And if I get to publish one journal or conference paper, mm -hmm. then he will give me the reference of his guide who mm -hmm. under whom he has done postdoctorate. So you can will refer, him. yes, he will mm -hmm. refer to him. He will refer me to him and I can get a hundred percent scholarship, PhD, sponsored PhD in US so that, or yeah. these opportunities are there. Mm -hmm. So that means if some student joins IIT Jodhpur and uh, starts putting effort in right direction then getting job or getting career opportunity is not a problem right Sandeepan? no 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 sir i i am telling i told you the only negative portion is the coursework mm -hmm. on four subjects you have mm -hmm. to study extra mm -hmm. compared to other iits or nits mm -hmm. this is the only negative but otherwise i didn't see any problem mm -hmm. there mm -hmm. so what do you say to students who keep on writing gate years after years three years four years five years thinking that their gate score is not good and good that for them means maybe 850 plus or something and they keep on chasing that uh, hypothetical uh, objective okay so i didn't go for the second draw <laughs> considering my gate score was only 540 around so 
some many students think you need to get seven seven hundred plus scores. So I can say if money is not a problem, like I what should I say? I gave up my stipend mm -hmm. to get into IIT. Mm -hmm. This is my case. If money is not a problem, mm -hmm. then they can really look these mm -hmm. opportunities provided by like mm -hmm. IIT Jodhpur. Mm -hmm. Even if it is it is only two lakh, and I tell you honestly one thing. If somebody is not having money at all, yeah. they will surely give him two three lakh rupees. That is not a problem. Yes, for Native yes. Bombay, they are getting 10, 15 lakh. For other IMs, they are yes, getting 25 yes. lakh. So if you can get a job of 8, 10 lakh plus, so spending two lakh is not a problem. And moreover, you get branding also, and that that should not be a constraint, actually, in my opinion. Yes, yes. So for thinking of, you know, even if you are preparing sitting somewhere or preparing a place like Delhi or Hyderabad. You know, you need to spend rent and all that comes out to be the same amount. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that way it should not be a problem. But yes, if you get opportunity, you should proceed there. Yes. I, I must say, Sandeepan, it is a really informative session from your side. You have told yes. a lot of many things and it will be very, very helpful to the students. And uh, I must share this thing with the students so that they take the right decision for them. Yes, sir. So thanks a lot, Sandeepan, for your time. Yes, sir. Thank you.